Good morning guys, let's take a quick look, uh, recently I've been bombarding the YouTube with loads of different updates, so if this is the first video you've seen of me in a while, I would recommend first things first, go back and check the last three to four videos that have been released also, so you're not missing out on what's going on. First things first, let's take a quick look at Carnival. Let's move myself out of the way. Right now you've got mystery cards ongoing. What you need to be doing is flipping all nine over. And uh, I've made many videos on mystery cards before. It's actually a very, very good event if you're looking for a couple of things, okay? Um, for your mount, it's a very good event for your mount. So if you've got a new mount or looking to acquire a new mount or something like this, uh, it's very good because of the fact that you can see how many armament chests I've just picked up a level three a level two two of them no three level twos and one level one okay also it's giving you steel plates which also go towards your mount as well and as you do this section you can look at my mouse on the bottom right lucky reward as you're filling up this bar you get to collect a level four, I believe, armament chest. Yeah, it is. That's always been the case. Okay. Um, you're also getting anvil and you're getting soul fragments. Soul fragments are beautiful and majestic. Okay. Because it's for amplifying. So the way to look at it is lucky bar is for sky realm. Okay. Because the things you're getting in here... Um, you know, they're best for the sky. For example, woven feathers, sky souls, emblems, anzu. These are all directly related to sky realm, okay? And your sky wings, etc. Mystery cards, we just covered what that event is for. When such an event like Carnival comes up, guys, uh, people start bugging out. You know, I can't take part in every event. Maybe you shouldn't take part in every event. Pick a specific event which your character or your profile is in need of doing and power on with that one. Okay? So, consumption is looking like this for me right now. I've hit milestone 1 and milestone 2 and um, I believe there's a day left uh, to hit milestone 3. But we'll keep a close eye on that one and see what happens i am low on diamonds right now so we'll see what the issue is over there just checking on my inbox real quick um to hall of fames all right cool so that's the situation with this event guys yeah um we're going to take a look at what else is open right now in Carnival. You've got your recharge shop, which is open right now. Um, you need to be recharging at least 2,000 during this period to be able to gain access. What you could be doing is quite a lot. There's loads of new items in here. Um, if you've got the capacity, you could be buying three different uh, mounts in the recharge shop. It uh, doesn't mean that it's cheap and it's a great deal. It just means it's available for you to do if that's what you want to do, okay? You also got Angel Wings, if you haven't got it. Morph Rods and uh, Soul Fragments again in here. Anvil, Talent Stones and stuff like this, okay? So that's that. Um, what else is going on? Surprise Shop. It tends to change every single day. But one thing you should pay attention to, guys. It's not just whatever you see here. Okay, this is just for the pet sale. This icon here, there's two different sections to this. So that's for pets. You could click the bottom one and it changes the items for Sky Wings. Okay, so these items are ongoing as well. The way I see the surprise shop is they give you a set amount that you could get for a very good rate, which would be 50 or 60% off on the right hand side over here. For example, Phoenix Frags, you get 10 for 50% off 
the rest you can get 100 uh, at 20 percent off so if you're working towards something and you're very eager it might make sense to plan ahead so maybe if you need phoenix frags which i wouldn't recommend because you could get this without killing yourself every day if you're participating in skywing boss and stuff like this but for example we're using it as an example if you're working on this buy the amounts that you're able to buy and then just wait for another event which is at a very good price also okay we just covered recharge uh, shop as well um, one thing I want to be covering in my last video I done the uh, metamorphine psychology or philosophy or whatever you want to call it okay depending and um, a lot of people are asking so how did you do that so they hadn't seen the previous video in this video let me show you uh, this is the pet spider to turn my pet into a spider this icon should appear how to get that icon to appear is over here okay so all I clicked on was morph you get this page it's like a talent of your morph it's a morph enhance at this milestone here is where I got the spider um, if you click the plus sign here guys yeah as you're doing last guardian like I explained you're getting these fragments so you're able to add and then come down here and it says how much you got available here are you able to go to the next stage and so on so forth so that's that um, can I just say real quick I have these two and uh, bosses but in my opinion phantom guys phantom is amazing okay um, first of all this shared skill for me is very good I'm a guild leader um, I got loads of small BR players as well as big BR players who uh, I need to be looking after it's my job okay so what this shared skill can do for you is for example in world boss or something like this or even in ice fire if you're at a crystal for example and your team is getting hit or whatever if i use this shared skill sacrifice 15 percent of your own current hp to heal allied players within 13 range of 30 percent max hp i think that's fantastic in layman's terms is i take away my own hp and whoever's around me that's a guild member or a team member gets to get regenerated in HP that's fantastic that is also another thing I like about the Phantom which I don't like about my Dark Tyrant is that when I hit my special for damage it's instant the Phantom gets it out and bang straight away no problem the Dark Tyrant however it's very delayed for him to do his whole animation and then whatever by that time the enemies run around you standing right behind you uh, if you are a legacy of discord player i know you know i'm right okay so for this pair that's meant to be a very rare uh, sorry boss i believe that they should have maybe made his skill a little bit faster but do not be worried because what you could be doing is um you can actually go into here. Um, let me just show you. I did see somewhere that you can replace the skills of them, if I'm not wrong. Okay, so you go to equipped skill. Right. So if there's something you do not like, but I've got loads of different bosses, so I've got all these that I could be using. Um, I could replace any of my skills which is pretty decent guys okay and um, phantom is a thumbs up from me definitely a thumbs up from me also if you're going to mastery and you've been working again in last guardian use your fruits and uh, get to work on this do you know what i'm saying um i don't have enough frags it takes a while but you need more fruit but it's something you should be working on. Each boss has its own section like this, a bit like um, talent stone trees, okay? So you go to mastery for that.
each one has a different one depending on his uh, rarity as well for example this one i've been doing well at it's my level two but if you go to mastery i've got this unlocked and defense unlocked as well so this is a good boss for me but i'm not using him at the moment i've uh, equipped dark tyrant and phantom at the moment hopefully i get number three unlocked and i'm able to have three different bosses then i'll bring that one into play as well don't want to bombard you too much guys but uh, for the time being this is today's update let's get on top this is my current br and uh, let's keep pushing let's keep having fun and have a great week like and subscribe